now the government is racing against time on air airport privatization. Our sources tell Bloomberg TV India that UP government is trying hard to finish the process before March when the model of, for code of conduct comes into force. Sumit Shah is joining us with more details. Sumit, uh, what seems to be the plan here? Absolutely, the top sources in the Ministry of Civil Aviation are telling us that the ministry is running a race against time to get the entire project of privatization of six airports done uh, before March because once March approaches and the model code of conduct for the impending elections come into force, no executive decisions will be allowed to be uh, taken. Ministry sources are also telling us that this uh, uh, this uh, crunch uh, in time is because, uh, because the model concession agreement which was prepared by the Planning Commission was summarily rejected by the ministry as they had several differences with it and they had to work on the model concession agreement uh, right from the scratch and the work is still uh, uh, being done. However, a request for proposal um, is ready and the, and the bidders would come and uh, start bidding on those, um, uh, on, on those airports. Civil Division Ministry sources are also telling us that the airport development fees will not be charged for any of these airports. Remember, this was a fee that was uh, highly contentious, was also raised by uh, uh, CAG um, in, in, uh, in the case of um, Delhi Airport. Uh, as far as uh, user development fees goes, uh, ministry sources are telling us they'll make sure that the user development fees is well within limit, um, viable for any airport and uh, good for consumers. Um, they're also saying that UDF will not be allowed to, uh, to be raised uh, steeply as we go along. So it'll be interesting to see how ministry goes about doing this because they don't have much time. We'll keep a close eye on it and um, uh, get the story to you.